is up guys, Noli here and welcome to the Christmas Roundup video. We're going to be looking at a lot of the masks sent in to me this Christmas. Uh, they were absolutely brilliant and didn't quite win, uh, but I'd first of all like to say this is obviously the winning mask, the lover boy Santa, naughty Santa. But there was a very similar mask to this that I completely overlooked and the, the slight reason for that is I don't actually have the colour for it. I do not have blood wed, blood Blood red, not blood wed, blood red and white. And because of that, I completely overlooked it. However, Noble Slayer, I completely apologize to you for not mentioning you. And because you did a mask so similar, the only difference was a slight change in the color. Um, I'd like to offer you a consolation prize. If you get in touch with me, send me a message. I get a little something for you to make up for that. Anyway, so that's Noble Slayer's design, just a slight change in the colour, just blood red and white. So Christmas is cancelled is Sir Kelly's mask. He's got the Happy Santa mask with flesh, solid red, and the headshot pattern, which I, I found extremely amusing. Christmas is cancelled is a brilliant idea for the name as well. Anyone who named their mask got sort of extra bonus points. If I can find the headshot pattern, I can show you what it looks like. Why must you bounce around patterns? Why? Ruin everything. There it is. So evidently, Father Christmas is pleased as he may look. It's not quite the way he wanted it. Now, Andrew Kane gave me the American Santa. We got the chrome blue. This is just the sort of standard uh, setup for anything with the American flag or even the British flag. Uh, One Nation Under God. As soon as I can find that. Sort of multitasking here. Because I'm having to read these straight off my videos. And, and the colour. Oh god. The colour is white and blood red. So, again, slight issue with not having white and blood red. <laughs> now, I'm not sure whether white and blood red is in. Uh, oh, do I? I got light grey and blood uh, red. Have a look at that. That's not quite it, but it's, you know, <laughs> as close as we can possibly get it. I'm sorry about not having that colour. I'm not sure whether it's an infamous item. Um, and so, yeah, that was a pretty awesome message, by the way. That one totally could have won. Again, the slight issue being that I couldn't make it perfectly. Oh, God, I ground. I ground. See, I can't say I grinded. I did a lot of... Uh, Payday 2 jewelry runs to try and get this stuff, but I just couldn't obtain the items for it. And I'm not saying this would have won if I had the items, I'm just saying I apologise, I can't show it off properly. So up next, these were all on the original videos, we've got, <laughs> funny name for it, the Stoned Papa Smurf. It's one I have to sort of interpret myself. I don't believe the background colour really matters, however, I think it is a solid second. And then a sort of um, light bluey colour. Or is it a solid second? I have no idea how to make this mask. Anyway, it's a pretty complex blue looking mask. Santa looking pretty stoned out of his mind. So that was the uh, s -Graphs. He's obviously turned up an awful lot to streams. And also, he's been involved in lots of my Mask of the Days. So, kudos to you. I uh, really appreciate the support. I'd like to thank everybody and anybody who commented, who made a mask, just who was involved in my Christmas. I absolutely love it and the most painful thing for me was seeing the names come up that won. Not because I don't like those people, not because I don't know those people, just because I knew not everybody could win and it really bothered me. I don't know why. I, uh, I don't think I'm a very good giveaway hoster because I want to give everybody something and I don't necessarily <laughs> have the funds to give everybody something. So, let's look at a couple more. I happen to remember one of these, at least vaguely remember. I know it's, sorry, that's my own video in the background. I know it's solid blood, blood red. It is the Cracker. Cracker, where are you? This is my friend's mask, which is why I remember it very well. Oh god, maybe you should have done it that way. And the uh, solid red, solid blood red. 
Solid Red was his decision. And that is the uh, Bloodstained Santa. Pretty much the same idea as the headshot pattern. It's just the cracker works slightly differently. Makes him look a little more blood spattered, but he has these big red patches around his eyes. So, uh, as far as the other Father Christmases go, another really good one was the Masked Santa, as I mentioned yesterday. With that, it was as grudly as one. Uh, there were a couple. I'll just show you one example. We got leather. We have the masked villain. Uh, a few guys did this. Brilliant jobs, by the way. I uh, I really like this mask. The, the main issue with this mask was so many people did it. I'd just like to say that the masked villain pattern has jumped since where it was yesterday. Thanks, game. And finally, red and blue. So yeah, this is the mask Santa. Uh, there was also a nice dark one, like a sort of dark, dark black and magenta one. Something like that. He is a uh, pretty scary looking mass villain. <laughs> Not. If you give him black eyes, he does look a little bit uh, demonic. Anyway, up next, we'll finish with Santa and I'll show you the awesome Dolph mask I was given very recently. So I just have to find the video. Let's go back and have a look at Dolph, one of my favourite new additions to the game. I love Dolph. It really is a good looking mask. So I believe it was on my Rudolph video, which didn't quite turn out the way I wanted it to. But it was nearly there. I did get a, uh, a message showing me the fair pattern. Who was that from? It was from, um, I believe that's Saint. Saint Legend, he's a turned, up, turned up for a couple of streams. That seems to be the background he uses. Anyway, Krampus by uh, Eli Wiginis. It's a totally new and interesting mask. It is the Dolph, the fur, so obviously I can't really show that one off. The uh, zebra colors, dark gray and orange. So let's get the zebra. I have not used the zebra in what seems like forever. Dark grey and orange. What I particularly liked about this mask, obviously this was an entrance into the Father Christmas mask, but uh, it used dark grey and orange, which is a colour I've never used before. Obviously for fair, I've sort of been replacing it with bronze. And that that is Krampus. Pretty damn evil looking uh, anti-Santa, basically. Apparently I think it's like a German folklore. And he goes around... Instead of placing presents on the children's beds or in their stockings, he just gives them coal, which uh, I'm sure once upon a time would have been very practical. However, I believe he's the sort of evil, malignant version of Father Christmas. So, this is Krampus. He's always known to be sort of devilish with horns. Uh, awesome looking, sort of Christmassy themed mask. So, guys, th that rounds off Christmas for me. This is Boxing Day, of course, the 26th of December. I'm still going to have very special videos before the year is out. going to be continuing streaming almost every night around about 7 o'clock GMT. So if you guys work out your time around that and come along and join in with the stream. Uh, obviously I'm going to be giving out those copies of Payday 2, those copies of Daisy, Starbound and Bioshock to those of you who want. Do get in touch with me as soon as possible. I said it a little bit in the TF2 video, all you have to do is add me. And contact me before the 31st of December, New Year's Eve. Uh, if you do not do that, you will be out of the draw and I'll redraw it for another guy to replace you. Obviously, I have to put a time limit on these things just so people do eventually claim their prize and it doesn't just sit in my inventory forever. So remember, get in touch with me if I've said you win a prize. There are now six prize winners. Uh, I hope you had a great Christmas. I can't wait to see what the new year holds. Guys, I will see you later.